So now we are turning back on the system. So first of all, we go to these breakers and we check that they're out. So this is off, this is off. Then we go to slave one inverter and we flick the switch up. Watch the screen. And it says boot and SMA. Gives the year of manufacture. Then there's a, a short delay and then it says ready, wait for master. So this is now ready to go. Mm. We do the same on this one, flick it up, watch the screen, it goes through its procedure. Ready, wait for master. So now we go to the master, and we flick the switch again. See it come on. And now it says standby mm -hmm. to start inverter, press hold, uh, uh, press enter and hold. So here we go. To start inverter, hold enter. We hold and enter, mm -hmm. counts down. Mm -hmm. We go the beep and the symbols now indicate that it is ready to start. So we've now started the master and both slaves. If we look at the slave screen, we see that it displays ready and operational. Okay? We're now ready to reconnect to the site. So we do that by switching this MCB here. So now the site is fed again with 230 volts from these inverters. If we have mains or grid, we want to enable the uh, supply to the inverters. We go to this one and we flick that up. So now if the mains is on or the generator is on, that will then supply the inverters automatically. And that's all we have to do to put the system back online.